Well, today I'm going to try to make Roberta Trainer's recipe for unleavened bread. Um, unleavened bread is a biblical food. It goes back to the Exodus when the Jews had to leave Egypt. They weren't able to rise their bread, so they took unleavened bread. And from then on, when they commemorate Passover, even to this day, they eat unleavened bread according to the command of Moses. So I'm going to try to make it. It sounds simple. We'll see. Start out with one and a half cups of flour. Throw in a half teaspoon of salt. Mix it together. All right. And then the recipe says to cut in one and a half to two and a half tablespoons of olive oil with what's called a pastry blender. I have no idea what a pastry blender is, um, so I'm using a wood spatula. And we'll just uh, see if we can mix that in. And then after all of that, it says to um, slowly mix in um, a half cup to two thirds cups of ice water. I'm assuming there's a reason why it has to be ice water, so I'm going to go with the instructions here. So it says a little bit at a time, so we'll call that a little and mix it in. It says you mix it in until it peels away from the bowl. All right, well. Hopefully you have to mix it in until it looks like dough. All right, now we've got this dough, I guess. And uh, then it says to knead it a little bit. Uh, clean hands. Uh, hopefully I don't need to say that. Um, but we'll knead it a little bit here. All right, then supposedly you divide it up into two groups and you flatten it with a fork. So it's a quarter inch thick. Okay, then, then it says you pierce it with the fork. Good for all your aggression and anxiety. And then you lightly salt it. Um, I'm using my secret ingredient. I'm going off script and using garlic salt because, well, it's garlic and it's salt. It's the two best food groups in the world. This is the perfect jar. Right here, a little garlic unleavened bread. There we go. All right. Now the next step, I forgot to tell you this, I'm preheating a pan in the oven at 375. So the next step is to put it in the hot pan. And I'm gonna cheat and just leave it on the aluminum foil. because it's cleaner that way. And you bake it for 20 to 25 minutes. All right, they're out of the oven now. They're cooled down. This is what it looks like. I have no idea how it's gonna taste. Let's give it a try. Actually, this is the garlic one. It doesn't taste too bad. I give myself a pat on the back. Uh, this is Roberta Trainer's recipe for unleavened bread. Now you get to give it a try. Thanks for watching.